Welcome back to the Heads Up Show. I have a very special guest with me, Elizabeth. Hey, Steve. How are you doing? I'm great. How are you? I'm, I'm, I'm fantastic. <laughs> so you are adorned in your finest Ravens apparel. I am. And this is all about you today. All of this. Like, do you feel special? I do feel special. Okay. This well, was a, this was a surprise. This was a surprise. Yes. So Elizabeth was given this gift by a very special person who said, I just want Elizabeth to have this amazing thing. You're a Ravens fan. I'm gonna teach you how to upgrade your licensed helmets into just badassery. Awesome. Have you ever done anything with helmets before? I have not. As a matter of fact, I don't even think I've touched a helmet before. <laughs> okay, perfect. So let's get into taking this thing apart so we can do all the cool stuff to it. What okay. do you say? I'm ready. All right. Hemi that screw gun. Actually, better yet, you do it. Why don't you take these screws out? You know how to use that thing, I'm sure. And then while you're doing that, I'm gonna distract you by asking you questions. Okay. So let's talk a little bit about the Ravens and wh why. Why are you a Ravens fan? You live in South Carolina. But I was born and raised in Pennsylvania, okay. New York, Pennsylvania, Okay. which is really just over the Maryland line. Okay. Um, probably about an hour and 15 minutes from Senate. Oh, wrong hey button. Hey now, easy up. About an hour and 15 minutes from Center City, Baltimore. Okay. So you grew up watching the Ravens. Actually watching the Steelers. Oh, yeah. Uh, my dad was a big Steelers fan. Yeah. And uh, you, you want me to what? get that one? I, yeah. I need some glasses. Uh, oh, I hear you. Uh, okay, go I, ahead, I got you, I got you. My dad was a big Steelers fan back in the day, and um, the Terry, Terry Bradshaw and all of that. Yeah. Uh, my uncle is a huge Steelers fan to this day, but I got into it because of my brother. But I mean, that's a rough house divided. It is. It is. Whoa. So. Um, Can you hand me those scissors? Christmas why time. Why don't you cut that off? Christmas time is usually extra special. I'm a lot of times that's when the Steelers and the Ravens play their second game. Yeah. So. Um, There's always blood. Oh, yeah. 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 Wow. So, okay, now you will have this incredible thing. Why don't you get rid of that for me? Ah, nicely done. Okay, so I like to take the face mask off and the chin strap off because now we have a nice stable situation okay. to work on. I have special things for you. So Very nice. front and rear 3D bumpers. Since we work with almost all of these teams, we provide these teams with bumpers. And because of that, we often have them in house. And that means you get all the cool stuff. What else? What else about the Ravens? Um, because there's a very special thing on this desk that people are probably like, can't believe that we're not talking about this guy yet. So that is as close as humanly possible as we can get to the one and only. Ray Lewis. Tell me about who are you wearing? Uh, well, this this is my favorite number. It's yep. kind of like a family number. Okay. I played basketball in high school. 21 was my number. My brother was 21 when he played basketball. He's younger than I am. Oh, that's cool. So it's just kind of our number. Okay. Um, and so it's Ladarius Webb when he played for the Ravens. All right. Um, and I really started watching the Ravens back in the Ray Lewis era. So, you know, it's getting hot in here. He'd come out into that stadium, <laughs> rip that sod apart, yes. and the fans would go crazy. It was awesome. It was a great show to watch. It really was. You know, it was football, but it was a show. Exactly. So. Yeah, it's no different than it is now, right? Let's be honest. That mask right there is the CU. S two B D C O S, but but you knew that, <laughs> yeah. Right. <laughs> right. So super duper hard to find. They're they're really really rare. I I can't believe that we actually had one of them, but I'm excited you got it because I can tell how into this you really are. I am. I this is amazing. All right. W what a gift. Really. It, it is. Yes. Yes. You were taken care of. Now. We took the warning label off because okay. it comes with that big stupid one. And we're putting on this clear purple one. And then we have an embossed tech American flag. I would like you to put the decals on. Okay. I know that you watch football because you put the decals on straight. 
most people don't realize they're like oh but it followed like no the seam is like your flagpole and there you go well done okay Thanks. so i'm saying you come in and i could tell you were like wow like right mm -hmm. tell tell the folks a little bit about your day so far well it's very interesting because when i came um i um and i was getting this surprise i really wasn't sure what it was all about and what it entailed um, especially driving up to the facility you know i came in and um the helmets that are all over the place were really quite amazing. So it took a while to take it all in and then to have the tour and to understand all that goes into the safety of the football helmet and how they're actually made. And one of the things that um, was really surprising to me is the decals and the logos that are on them that they come off every week. Oh, yeah. So the decals, the face masks at the highest level, you know, you got to look good for TV. The slightest little blemish, they're out of there. Right. Yeah. The equipment managers of a high level football program, you would not believe the level of work that they have in any given week. Big shout out to all the equipment managers out there because Absolutely. that is a grind. It's the the shield and yep. the chin straps. I mean, the colors and the clips. The buckles and, and warning labels. It's and just really quite amazing. Speaking of, we have a liquid metal, one of our unbranded visors. We went back and forth a little bit between the Oakley Legacy, the gold, which was really sweet, mm -hmm. and this. And I, I had an opinion, but I kept my mouth shut, and it was to go with this one. You were torn, but I'm glad you went with this. I, 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 I like the gold. Um, I thought the gold would go well with the clips. Yes. But I like the intensity that, that this particular um, I agree. shield brings. I agree. Do me a favor. Help me out here. Okay. Slide that thumb screw right in there and crank that down. Kind of looks like a transformer. I love it. Yes. All right, let me see. Nice. That's, that's, that's legit. It's sharp. This thing is just gonna scream just aggressive. Like I said, it's, it's badassery. Yeah. Right? Now, this is kind of bringing a little bit of a modern feel to this Ray Lewis look. But the truth is this is a Riddell Speed helmet. So it's not as aggressive and as current as the Speed Flexes. So it does have that kind of look because this, this shell has been around for like 14, 15 years now, you know? All right, so screw gun. All right. That's bored. <laughs> <laughs> so grab a screw, Let's just get that first one going. Elizabeth. It's awesome. Look at what you have put together. I mean, I, I think you know what you have to do now, right? I mean. Put it on. Gotta put it on. Absolutely. Let's go, let's see this thing on. <laughs> yeah. What do you think? I tell you what, it looks amazing. It's really, awesome. that thing is just, that it's is awesome. nasty. Good work. Heck yeah. So it's pretty heavy, isn't it? It is. That face mask is like two and a half pounds. <laughs> That's awesome. Well, listen, it was awesome for you to come by. I really enjoyed doing this with you. And if you are an influencer or a business and you want to be on set with me, just like Elizabeth, in the description, you can click a link and book your session. Thanks for watching. Till next time. Cheers. Good job. Thanks. You did that was good. awesome. You did good. You did really good. <laughs>